thousand days to go to the Paralympic Games. That's a thousand days for people to get involved. A thousand days for us at the organising committee to really put all the steps in place to make London 2012 the best Paralympic Games ever. It's a really, really important milestone. The Paralympics are such a large part of our story. It's a thousand days to go to um, London 2012 opening ceremony and I'm really, really excited. It's only a thousand days to go until the Games, the Paralympic Games in London in 2012. It's going to be a very exciting time and for, for me as an athlete, I'll be aiming to get selected for that team. Over the next thousand days, I'm going to be stepping up my training a little bit. We've got a lot of competitions next year, qualifying for places for London 2012. Over the next 1,000 days I'll be training six days a week um, to be selected for the 2012 um, squad and that's my main goal for basketball. Over the next 1,000 days I will be um, intensifying my training because the Paralympics is most definitely my dream. It's my long-term goal and I really want to compete at them. Over the next 1,000 days I'm going to be training hard in the pool. I train six days a week so it's a lot of training, not many days off competing at nationals and trying to get my, my qualifying times so that when we come to London, you know, I can win that gold. I think it's going to be the greatest games I can ever go to and I really don't want to miss out on that opportunity. It's just a brilliant opportunity for us to put on an event which really brings Paralympism sort of to the heart as well as the minds of, uh, of the British people. It's moving ahead at a real pace. We're going to do everything we can to make it a spectacular event. Everything that we're doing over the next thousand days, we have to ask ourselves a question. Will this make for a better Paralympic experience in 2012? And if it will, then we should do it.